Hey everyone, hope you guys are doing well. So this is DeMarco with LVG Marketing. And I wanted to make these videos here for two reasons. One, um, I know there's a lot of people that are out of work or underemployed and they have a lot of time with their hands. And two, I have some information that I think would benefit the public and how to make extra money on the side. So I'm gonna just make all these awesome free videos and free content and so you guys can really benefit from it and I hope it can help you out. And if you know someone that would need it, then share this video. So let's get to it. So like the, like the headline said, uh, we're going to bootstrap how to make a business, an online business uh, within this quarantine time. You don't need to take out a loan. You don't need a lot of money. Uh, like the headline says, you can either do it for $29 a month or you could pay the things in advance for, for a whole year for about $407. And I'll break that down for you. So let's start with the store. Let's say you want to build a store and you want to start selling t-shirts, hats, mugs, whatever it is you want. I recommend Shopify. All my clients use Shopify. I tell them to use Shopify because it's the easiest that I've experienced, which I like. Plus Shopify uh, recently offers now a 90 day free trial, which is great. So if you don't even like the platform, you can discontinue it within the 90 days and not get charged anything. So, which is great. So there's two ways you can do about it. One, you can do the monthly 29 bucks a month, right? You can pay an easy 29 bucks and build your store. Uh, it's, a do it, it's a DIY, it's a do it yourself. There are courses and stuff like that and I'll produce videos for that. Or what I recommend, if you're gonna get some stimulus check, I recommend you pay for it the whole year up front, 312, right? You get a little bit of a savings and you don't have to worry about monthly payments every month. It's just taken care of, it's done, boom right? So you don't have to hire an, a web designer. You don't have to hire some web developer or some coder. It's a very, very simple platform that I'll post videos on how to do. So 312 to get your own website. The second part that I recommend that you get is Bluehost. Now you're going to need a domain name, right? You're going to need a website name. It's going to be uh, Mary's poodles.com or something, right? And then you want to, of course, make it look professional. You want to have your website name and you want to have an email. Info at, at, at Wendy's Poodles, contact me at Wendy's Poodles, et cetera, right? So you want to have a good domain and a professional email so customers can reach out to you because you don't want to look like you have everything at Gmail looks doesn't really look that professional. Now, you can host with Bluehost, which I like. I have all my websites on there. And for a whole year, it's 95 bucks. So 95 plus 312 comes out to the 407. So you're taking care of all your online expenses when you're up front. Boom, that's it. You don't have to worry about anything else. After that, then we need to go into what you want to sell. So I'll briefly touch on that, and I'll have more videos on this later on. But the great thing about starting an online business and the way the internet is now you don't need to buy a lot of in inventory like we used to 30, 40 years ago. There are things now called print on demand, which I'm going to show you right now. And then there's another strategy called drop shipping, right? They both have their pros and cons. I'll briefly go over it. But what I really want to show you is with this downtime that you have, you can technically build an entire company, an entire store right now. So this is printful.com. Link is in the, in the description below. And these products here are all white label, meaning you can put your own logo, your own image, picture of yourself, or if you, or anything you want, and you can sell it, right? You could do t-shirts, mugs, leggings, uh, stickers, hats, phone cases, tote bags, and so many more, right? A lot of cool things. So a lot of you are wondering, well, how does it work? So let's check out a product real quick. Let's do women's, for instance. And... This concept, it's abbreviated pod, but print on demand. So the way this works is you build a product and you upload it to your store. I know your next question is, well, how do I build a product? I'll make videos on that later, but for right now, I just wanna explain to you the process and how this concept works. So this product costs, this t-shirt costs $12.95, right? So this is what it costs you. It costs for printing, shipping, and um, yeah, it costs for them to print the product, to, you know, the cost of the shirt is the product too, and they ship the product. They do all of it. You don't need to have t-shirts in your trunk. You don't need to have t-shirts in your house. 
et cetera. They do all the shipping and all the inventory. Therefore, this shirt costs $12.95. So if you were to sell this shirt, you would need to mark it up at $24.95 or $29.95, et cetera. Some of you are asking, will someone pay $29.95? Absolutely. If it's a cool enough shirt and it's unique enough and they can't find it anywhere, then the answer is yes. Okay. Now, the way pod works, print on demand is, is they'll only charge you the $12.95 once you make a sale, which is awesome, right? That means you don't have to pay to collect the shirts or anything. They'll basically charge you the $12.95 as soon as you make a sale, and then you keep the difference. So if you charge us at $24.95, then that's a $10 difference. You sell 10 shirts a day, then you make about 100 bucks a day, and you didn't have to deal with any of the inventory because print on demand handles all the automations on the back end. Pretty cool, right? So basically it's very simple. You choose the colors and then you upload a design or you can write writings on the shirt. And I'll have videos on this, explain it to explain this more in detail, but that's what I wanna show you. That's what print on demand is. You can make a whole entire store with this. T-shirts, hats, mugs, you could build a whole brand. So that's print on demand. Next one is drop shipping. So we've all seen AliExpress and AliExpress, that we'll keep it at AliExpress for right now. And AliExpress is a big e-commerce giant for wholesalers, right? So think of this like wholesalers from around the world, not just China, but from around the world, get on this page to sell to consumers like us to the B2C. Now, you can also build a whole entire store without buying inventory and product. So let's, um, We'll take this bag, for instance. So as you can see, this bag retails for 51 or 85. I assume it depends on which bag I choose. So it looks like 63. So we'll stick with this one, 63 bucks, right? And we'll mark it up 20 bucks, so it costs $83. So once I make a sale, then I collect the difference. And then once you have the customer's information, you come in here, fulfill the order, the factory, or the wholesaler is going to ship this product to the client. You never see the product, but you'll collect the margin, the difference, which is great. And then you can also import these products into your new store that you just built, which I'll have courses on to do. So those are two methods that you can do in bootstrap, right? Like you have the time, if you're going to have a stimulus check, invest it in something that can help you uh, double, triple your money. So if, if setting up the whole process costs 407, I hope you could at least make double that. So, you know, you could pay yourself back and make some extra money. Now, by no means is this easy. This is not easy. You're building a business, except that what the internet has done in the last five years is that they've made things a little bit simpler. But if you're opening up a business online or at the mall, like a brick and mortar, it's still the same process of putting in the work and the effort. So, I hope you guys enjoy it. Check out these resources that I'll have for you in the link below and see if you guys want to start a business. And if you do and you do follow the links, keep watching the videos because I'll upload a whole bunch of videos on how to uh, get all this started. All right. Peace.